Okay. some seriously exciting news. Bay and I are building our dream gym. Say what? It's official. Okay, it is freaking official. So yeah, guys, after some serious contemplation, Bay and I decided to take the leap and look for a commercial space and pretty much just build our own freaking gym. As much as I love going to a gym in general, like a public gym, uh, it got a little hard to film content there. People tend to um, not really love when you try to film workouts and other things and take photos. So it got a little bit uncomfortable, a little bit uneasy, plus the hours of the gym got a little shysty for us and our schedule. So we decided just to do the damn thing. We found the perfect place that's literally a 13 minute drive from our home. And the best part is we could pretty much just do whatever we need to do here. It's going to be a full functioning gym. I'm talking dumbbells, weights like squat rack, Smith machine, actually just everything. We already started to pick out our equipment. So it's game on right now. This is not only just a place for Bay and I to obviously get our lifts in and sweat it out because we love doing that, but it's mostly going to be our filming slash office studio. Um, I kind of hinted about it on stories and some of you got it right. You knew what we were signing and it was signing for this baby here. So it's going to be a project. We're going to be painting the walls. As you can see, they're like two different freaking colors here. Not terrible, but we're going to paint the whole thing just one color, solid white. I'm also going to be doing a lot of try on hauls here for new releases and things like that. I decided it'd be best if we kind of tried out the activewear, girl, when new things come in, I can actually try it out for real instead of squatting down in front of my um, laundry room all the time. Not wrong with that, but you know what I'm saying? You wanna see the functionality. So when you enter, this space is about 675 square feet. So it's just the right amount of space for everything we're gonna need to put in it. I went based off of what I actually use religiously at an actual gym and got that equipment. We're getting it from Life Fitness. You've probably heard of them. They're really good with commercial equipment. <laughs> Shout out to my man, Justin. Yeah, Justin. Yeah, if you're in the Northern, like New Jersey, New York City area, hit up Justin from Life Fitness. He hooked us up. I just wanna give you guys a breakdown of what we're thinking about doing aesthetic wise to the place because you know, girl, I'm all about that aesthetic. I wanna feel like a I walk into this room and a weight is just lifted off my shoulders like it's a freaking cloud of s of euphoria and sweat and, mist. and sweat and mist Ooh, we cannot yeah have this. so first off um what you're looking at right now is uh, painted cement we are getting commercial grade rubber flooring throughout it's gonna be a light gray speckle yay and our gym equipment is going to be uh, custom. So it's going to be white frame and dove gray upholstery. So when you come in here, it's basically just gonna be tones of gray, white, black, obviously dumbbell, the rubber. Either way, we want it to be just fluid looking and not a bunch of different random colors. So it's gonna be very monochromatic, if you will, so. But mostly whites, lights, brights, airies. Ooh. Oh damn, ooh, ooh. Good thing we got insurance. This little wall here is gonna be something we don't really film with. <laughs> it's gonna hang our coats. Cause right now this is what I'm looking at hanging my coat on. The actual door itself can't have that. That's my freaking Gymshark puffer, like no. So we're gonna have a little coat hanger, wardrobe hanger thing. We're gonna have a little table, maybe a chair or two. And this obviously is gonna be nothing. We're gonna put some plants and stuff here. You're gonna see a lot of greenery cause your girl loves nature. I feel at ease and calm in life when I got plants around, whether they're fake or not. Don't judge. This right here, this whole wall is going to have the wall to wall mirrors. We decided on just having it on the one wall. It's not really necessary to have it on both. Plus filming, it might be reflective and you might catch Bay over here, making some weird faces and stuff like that. So wall to wall mirrors. This is where our dumbbells are going to go. Right here, y'all. Right next to the window is so where I can take some selfies, okay? With the dumbbells. Right over here, we have fixed barbells we're thinking about putting up. I love my fixed barbells, you know that. So it's gonna be like one of those pyramid 
fixed barbells. So basically free weights are gonna be on this wall. Empty gym tour. Over here is going to be our Smith machine. Pretty much I decided to go with the Smith machine and not your standard squat rack with the Olympic barbell because I'm gonna be honest with you, as much as I would love to be able to do that kind of thing, my lower back with my scoliosis just can't hang and I will F my shiz up and not be able to do anything for months. So Smith machine, make my life easier. This is a door to the bathroom and like a little hallway. Mm -hmm. So bathroom is around the corner. This also leads out as an emergency exit in case we'd be tearing it up too, too fiercely and we just steam up the place and cause a fire. That can happen sometimes, okay? So in order to maximize space, we actually got a lot of combination machines. So for example, we got one that is a leg extension and then it turns and converts into a hamstring curl. Those, that kind of idea. We actually even got a pull down machine where you can actually do rows as well. So it's combination machines to get, you know, the most out of your space. Even though we are making this a full-fledged gym with heavy duty machines, we still want that like breezy feeling, that space, you know what I'm saying? If I wanna jump rope and do other things, we can have the space for that. We don't wanna clutter up too much because I need space for my plants. We also have a back extension because I need that. I actually like to work my core on that as well. Right in the corner here is going to be our Freaking cables, man. I have been missing doing back and all sorts of shit on that. So I cannot wait for some freaking cables, baby. I'm ready for that. And then you obviously have the opposite wall, this same size as the wall to wall mirror wall. So it's a pretty long, nice size wall here. We're just gonna be putting the rest of the machines to be honest. So leg extension and leg curl machine is going here as well. It's gonna look good. So you can like kind of look out, still see yourself in the mirror a little bit. That's what I'm thinking. Uh, we actually are trying to keep most of this space empty for stretching, yoga, and things like that. Because I really think like you just never know when creating content when you're gonna need a basic wall <laughs> that has no distractions. You never freaking know, I'm trying to think ahead. And down the road, we didn't order it yet, but we are thinking, I know I am, of thinking of getting a cardio machine here. I, we need some kind of cardio. I know, you know, HIT is wonderful. You can only jump rope so much. So I think we're gonna get a treadmill and or stationary bike. So we will see on that though. See how much space we're left with. And yeah, so this is actually our first time with the keys in here with you guys. So thank you for sharing this amazing freaking. <laughs> Uh, guys, I am so excited to be able to like create this kind of content for you guys. Like I, I've, I've been waiting for this moment like forever. So yeah, guys, this is our gym. <laughs> I know there's not a lot to show you right now because we literally just walked in and we got nothing going on here. But definitely stay tuned because I do want to document this journey with you guys, especially if you're somebody who's considering doing something like this as well, or know somebody who's looking to do it. I'm pretty much gonna go into detail of everything that you can think of during this process. That's right. We're really excited to bring you guys the best, highest quality content possible. That's always been our goal. So now that we finally have a space to be able to do it on a daily basis, mm -hmm. uh, you know, thank you guys for your patience. We know the gym videos haven't been all there lately, but it's because we had this in the works. Yes. So now buckle up because it's going downtown, mm -hmm. girl. Yeah. It's happening. Mm -hmm. It's That's down. That. It's going now. So definitely follow your girl on IG also. And TikTok. Be and TikTok, yeah. There's gonna be, um. A lot of funny gym humor on TikTok, because that's what I like TikTok for, is just being freaking crazy. Our version of funny though, I don't know, you guys might not get it. <laughs> and Instagram, because there will be a lot more gym-based content on there as well. I know a lot of you have been asking, and again, I apologize, it's just been weird. Ever since we moved here, we didn't have our little makeshift home gym anymore in our yeah. living room. That's it guys, that is it for now. Uh, thank you all so much for watching, especially if you stayed till the end, I appreciate you very much. Um, that's it, right? We love you guys very, very much, and we'll catch you in our next video. Mwah.